Rumor has it that Israel's new INS Dracon will be capable of carrying the mysterious IDS Popeye turbo missile. The INS Dracon can accommodate up to 16 torpedoes and or mines as well as the Popeye Turbo. The Popeye Turbo is a turbofan-powered submarine-launched cruise missile, SLCM, with a range of at least 1,500 kilometers, 932 miles. It is widely believed that the Popeye Turbo missiles can be armed with a 200 kiloton nuclear warhead providing Israel with a second strike capability as part of its undisclosed nuclear arsenal. Currently, these missiles are launched via torpedo tubes. The INS Dracon will likely be able to launch vertically. The origins of the Popeye Turbo began in May 2000 when Israel reportedly tested cruise missiles capable of carrying nuclear warheads from German-built Dolphin-class submarines. The missiles, tested off Sri Lanka in the Indian Ocean, achieved a range of about 1,500 kilometers. Israel is believed to possess a nuclear warhead that can be fitted on these cruise missiles, containing 6 kilograms of plutonium. By 2002, Israel might have an operational air-launched cruise missile known as the Popeye Turbo. This missile might utilize components from the existing Popeye family of missiles, including the AGM-142 HAVNAP and Popeye II. The Popeye Turbo is believed to be similar or identical to the cruise missiles on the Dolphin-class submarines. Due to the missile's secretive nature, there's limited information available, even possibly for the U.S. intelligence community. Speculations arise on whether the missile's range has been under or overestimated, but the reported range aligns with Israeli target requirements. Larger torpedo tubes could potentially launch long-range nuclear-capable submarine-launched cruise missiles, SLCM. That's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date on AI developments.